Victoria Peak is one of the most popular and best attractions of Hong Kong and probably in Asia. But do you know where is the best photo spot? After watching this video, you'll be able to follow us to take stunning photos of the great half of you. Right now, I'm in the famous Victoria Peak with the iconic Victoria Harbour view. So in this video, I'm gonna compare like the photos taken from like different photo spots around the area of Victoria Peak so that you can find out which one is the best spot of taking the photos because some of the spots you have to pay for it like, such as this, the Peak Tower, you have to pay for the entrance fee but some of the spots like this one is free. So I'm gonna show you the photos taken from different spots and then you can find out which is the best spot. My name is Alpha. We have made another video about the attractions around the peak. Please check it out and don't forget to subscribe our Hong Kong Guy channel. The first Instagram spot I'm going to introduce is the landmark of the peak, the Peak Tower. The rooftop is called Sky Terrace and it will cost you $52 entrance fee per person. So basically this corner is the best spot obviously because this is the closest to the harbour So I'm gonna try my best to take photos of the harbour and to compare with other spots around uh, Victoria Peak and see how it goes This time I'm using iPhone 11 Pro to take the photos here on the rooftop of the Peak Tower, you can take one of the iconic postcard photos of Victoria Harbour. Even the default Hong Kong wallpaper in the Apple Watch was taken from here. In the ultra-wide and wide-angle photos, trees around the peak will be shot in the photos as well, which gives you a picture of nature and urban engaging with each other. Okay, so for $52, this is pretty much what you get, the view. And there's nothing else entertainment, nothing else to see, so just pure photo spot. The other places I'm going to introduce are all free of charge. The second one is Lions Pavilion, which is around 3 minutes walk from the Peak Tower. You will see a Chinese pavilion built by Lions Club and a great view. I'm gonna show you how the photos will look like from here. In the ultra wide photo, you'll see the Victoria Harbour much further from you than in the Peak Tower. There is a house at the bottom of the photo which kind of makes the photo less appealing. So you will need to zoom in a little bit to cut that out. I would say the view here is slightly worse than the Sky Terrace because here is lower than the Sky Terrace so it doesn't show that much of the harbour in the photo but the good thing is, it's free! The third place is the newly opened Peak Galleria so It's for this Peak Galleria shopping mall so there are shops, uh, restaurants, cafes the most famous attraction is the Monopoly Dreams so we actually made another video about this attraction so do check it out and so but what I'm gonna show you now is the observation deck here and this is the Monopoly Dream so check out the video we made before and this is the observation deck it is difficult to take a nice ultra-wide photo here because peak tower blocks part of the view so you need to switch to wide angle which looks not bad but there is a tree on the right side which blocks the view also a bit hard to take a perfect photo so comparing Lions Pavilion and this observation deck I recommend Lions Pavilion more because the photos taken there are more perfect so just like the peak tower this place can also see the south of Hong Kong Island which is awesome and free so, There's one less 
reason that you need to pay for the entrance fee of the like sky terrace. So this is pretty much a third spot. Okay, here, if you want to go for a walk, you go from the left. If you want to go to straight to the photo spot, go to the right side. The last spot I'm going to introduce is Lugard Road Lookout. It will take around 15 minutes walk from the peak tower, but trust me, it's worth it. Okay, this is another photo spot of the harbor. So in this place, you can see more like the west side of the Kowloon and also the west side of Ongha Island. Okay, so I would say this is the best part of taking panorama photos. So you see, 180 degrees of the harbor. It's too awesome. The view here is surreal. You can even see almost the whole Victoria Harbour from the west to the east. And it's just too easy to take great photos from here. Panorama and night photos are incredible. In conclusion, Lookout Road Lockout is the best spot among the other three. If you do not prefer walking, then you can choose either Sky Terrace or Lions Pavilion. This is just the perfect spot of taking photos of the harbour. Honestly, I strongly recommend you guys to just go straight to the lookout because the 30 minutes walk is totally worth it. I hope this video helps you take the best photos of the harbour. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.